Hello, my name is Ong Kai. In my home in Malaysia, I will come every morning at 4 a.m. and get ready for the day. I'll be just as lethargic as everyone else in the morning, but after a good shower, breakfast, and a quick change of clothes, I will feel much better and ready to come to Singapore where I attend school. The bus will take me to the CIP complex for immigration across the causeway to the Bullet checkpoint where the bus and MRT will take me to school. This has been my daily routine for the past nine years. Yes, it's tiring. Boys! I go to a regular neighborhood school in Singapore and I'm not even a top student, just an average one. I am now in Sex Week and a member of the National Cadet Corps. Wow, seriously, the experience was exhilarating, the best of my life. Boys, Sanandi, we. Oh man, that was my most proudest moment in Singapore. Boys, Sadi, the Kanawan Po, say. Kanwa, boys. Prime 
and the large number of ethnic Chinese is quite outnumber the Malay population in Malaysia. The hostility between the ethnic Chinese and the ethnic Malay finally erupted and violent crashes occurred on July 31st, 1964. 23 people died and 100 more were wounded. On the 9th of August, 1965, Lee's nightmare became a reality and the separation became official. However, I changed my mind to call for merger with Singapore when the anti-communist Singaporean leader Ong Eun Kwan was expelled from the PAP. But still won a by-election as an independent. I was concerned about the stability of the PAP as its collapse may have led to Singapore being used as a base to spread communism into Malaysia. Furthermore, I'd like to maintain a high number of Malays in Malaysia through the inclusion of Borneo Islands region, Sabah and Sarawak into the Federation of Malaysia. Malaysia is for Malay! Adopted non communal politics whereby I fought for equality for all, regardless of race or religion. In contrast, Amno, led by Tunku Abdul Rahman, advocated for the provision of special rights and privileges for the Bumi Putra or indigenous Malays, meant as a form of affirmative action as a straight Chinese and traditionally better economic affluence, and the Malays tended to be poorer. As part of a vote of peace between the two parties, Tunku Abdul Rahman assured me that the Alliance Party would not get involved in Singapore's domestic politics as long as the PAP confined its political role to Singapore. This riot occurred during the procession to celebrate Ma'awad, the birthday of the Islamic Prophet Muhammad. 25,000 majority Muslim Malays had gathered at the Pala. Aside from the recital of some prayers and the engagement in some religious activities, a series of fiery speeches was also made by the organizers. During the procession, clashes occurred between the Malays and the Chinese, which eventually led to a riot spreading out to other areas. There are multiple accounts and reports of how the riots have begun. I told you before, okay, clean up your own country or I'm going to ask you and the Europe to the Federation of Malaysia. You see, the whole of my adult life, I believed in Malaysia merger, in the unity of these two territories in ways that these two people are connected by geography, economics, the ties of kinship. The expulsion of Singapore from the Federation of Malaysia devastated Lee Kuan Yew. Who told you to come? Who told you? Who fooled her? Who told her? Who hugged her? Who told 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 her? Malaysia will be banned only for the Malay. Singapore will not be a Chinese country, a Malay country, or an Indian country. We will establish. Singapore is a multicultural society. What's going on here? I heard the conversation between Hong Kai and the rest of you. Are you going to tell me what's going on? Guys, why the hostility towards Hong Kai? Aren't you guys buddies? Sure, Hong Kai is Malaysia. Why does he get to leave the national anthem and the pledge? Why don't you choose one of us to stay? If you had just said you wanted to leave, I would have given it to you. And to me, it's because he's capable. I'm sure you all agree with me. Hong Kai did a good job, right? But sure, he's still a Malaysian. I know that, Kamal, but because I recognize ability over nationality, to me, Hong Kai is just as much of a Singaporean as any of you. He has been here long enough to be just as much of a even though he's not. So, can I do I spent most of my time here in Singapore. Then I be in Malaysia. And you guys should know that. Because I spend my time with all of you. I am Malaysian. And yes, I am a visitor in your country. I came here for an education. But along the way, I become comfortable here. Never have I thought you and I were different. But I guess I am wrong. In your eyes, I'm just a sister. There may be differences between Tunku and myself in our political views. But we both believe in the same principles. And that doesn't mean we are not friends. After all, we are neighbours. Economically or politically, what happens to them affects us too. This is matter the most to us. It is our responsibility to make sure that our country survives. I could see Singapore prosper while being independent. Merdeka! 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 Malaysia is 
Singapore gained independence on 31st of August 1957. Singapore gained independence on 9th August 1965. It's been an eight year gap. Sekali lagi dengan suara yang and together as one. Sama-sama kita melangkan dengan bersemangat. Merdeka! No matter where he's from, we just have to try and make friends and probably read up a bit more about the separation. My family may not be here, but my friends are. So I'm going to watch you. Okay, okay. I'm sorry, Hong Kai. I cannot do it. It's okay, guys. I understand your resentment. But trust me, never have I thought you and I were different. We may be different, but I am the same. 